Hi, George Cow here. So let me show you how to embed a YouTube video on your website in such a way that the at the end of the video, the related videos or suggested videos doesn't show up so that your visitor doesn't get distracted and go watch some other YouTube videos. They just stay on the content of your website. Okay, so let's say I, I'll give you an example here. Let's say I want to embed this video to my website. How do I, what would I do then? Um, first of all, typically when you come underneath the video, there is, it says share. Now click on embed, and when you click embed, you find this code there, but I want you to click show more. Okay, show more. All right. So under show more are a couple options people don't often realize is available. First, you can choose what the video size is on the website after you embed it. You can even choose a custom size if you want, but let's just say, let's just use this one for now. And the other thing is, here is the checkbox that says show related videos, suggested videos when video finishes. Uncheck that. Uh, I would also suggest click un unchecking this, uh, this one right here, this third checkbox, show video title and player actions. And this will then not have that distracting title there so the whole video shows. Now, you can even uncheck this if you don't want people, when they play the video, you know how there's usually the bar at the bottom that shows where they are in the video and how long the video is. Well, if you uncheck this, that will take that bar out completely. Uh, personally, I don't like that because I like to I like follow the golden rule. When I see someone's video on the website, I want to know how long it is. So I, I keep that checked just for my own, uh, my, my, I, I believe in that. So um, what you do now is once you've selected your options, if you want to do this privacy enhanced mode, you can click on this check uh, question mark to, to read more about what that means. So once you've got the code, you click on the code, you, you triple click, you click three times, one, two, three, and that selects everything. You press uh, Command C on your keyboard if you're on a Mac or on the Windows, it's Control C to copy it. You go to your website editor, here I am already. Uh, you choose to put an embed code. I don't know for your website editor what it, how you do it, but it's basically HTML or embed code. I click here, I paste the code that YouTube gave me, and then I publish the webs uh, I, I publish it because I'm done doing that. And I want to show you um, what it looks like uh, once I've published it now. Okay. So here's that video, and let's go ahead and play it and play to the end, or at least just skip to the end to see what happens. You see now, um, Hi, there's no. Uh, I'm going to. Okay, all right. Sorry about that. Uh, there's no bar at the top. There's still the, the player controls. I still allowed that, and uh, I'm going to skip to the end of the video and see what happens. Okay. Okay. All right. I'm going to um, just go to right there. Okay. See. All right. The video just finished. You see, the video just finished, and instead of looking, showing suggested videos, it's now just showing the, the the custom thumbnail, uh, of the video which I which I uploaded. So, uh, and if you're wondering, well, how do you upload custom thumbnails? Okay, let me show you how to do that, uh, real quick here. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna I'm going to show you that in a different video. So anyway, I, I hope this has been helpful, and uh, please let me know if it's helpful in the comments below. And um, I will see you in the next video. Thanks.